Inside Penn Place in downtown Wilkes-Barre, mail-in ballots made their way into drop boxes as the countdown to election day nears closer. But concerns over missing mail-in ballots have county manager Romilda Crocomo and election bureau members rechecking their records. The local Democratic chair uh, reached out to us uh, and indicated that he believes that there are a group of uh, individuals who didn't receive their ballots. Uh, we asked him for a list. Uh, he provided that and uh, we're going through the list. Crocomo says more than 40,000 residents signed up to receive mail-in ballots in Luzerne County. Those names are sent to a printing company in Rochester, New York and mailed out from there. In our records, the files that we produce that are sent to the printer, they have all been, they've all been sent to the printer. Luzerne County is working closely with the Department of State in the lead up to Election Day. If you're planning on voting by mail and have not received your ballot yet, officials say there are ways to make sure your vote counts. In a statement given to Newswatch 16, a representative from the Department of State says, quote, voters who received an absentee or mail-in ballot may vote in person on Election Day if they bring their mail-in ballot materials with them to be voided. If you do not receive your mail-in ballot in time for November 5th, the department says, quote, voters who requested a mail-in ballot and did not receive it or don't have it to surrender may vote by provisional ballot at their polling place. The provisional ballot will be reviewed by their county board of elections after election day to determine whether it can be counted. Crocomo tells us the elections bureau has already received completed mail-in ballots from tens of thousands of voters across Luzerne County. We had uh, loaded over 37,000 mail-in ballot returns that goes into the state system. Uh, obviously they're going to con continue to come in up until uh, November 5th and we'll be processing those. For more information about what to do if you have or have not received your mail-in ballot, head to WNEP.com. Jack Colkin, Newswatch 16, Luzerne County.